guys, welcome back to my channel. So I know it's been a really long time since I've done a video. I think I say it at the beginning of every single video now. Um, but I wasn't really sure what to film. But lately I've been buying some really random things. Um, and I kind of thought I would do like a random haul of all the brand new stuff that I've bought over the past sort of maybe, maybe like month to two months. Or maybe even a little bit further back than that. Um, because I often don't just buy obviously like clothes and stuff. And or makeup. And I kind of thought it would be quite fun to start showing you guys what I'm buying. Um, just like random stuff really so um, if you're interested then keep watching oh also just before I jump into showing you guys everything that I've bought um, I just want to say a massive massive thank you for all your supportive messages um, and it, it just meant so much to me all the nice stuff you said in my last video which now is like must be well over a month or so ago now so it's obviously been a couple of months now since everything and I'm super super happy I've got some really exciting stuff happening that I can't wait to tell you guys about but I'm not going to do it until um, a few more things have been solidified so I can share them with you but yeah, if you're interested to know what's going to be happening on my channel and more in my personal life, then make sure you're subscribed so you can check out some really exciting new stuff that's going to bring some really exciting new videos. Um, but yeah, I just want to say a massive thank you to all of you. You're all so lovely. I love you all. And your support has meant so much more because it's made it so much easier to be a lot more public about it now. But anyway so enough of that I will now be showing you all the random stuff that I have bought lately so one thing that I bought is actually a cookbook and this is the Thug Kitchen um, Eat Like You Give Up but um, I got this because it's a vegan cookbook now I'm not vegan I'm not vegetarian I have been vegetarian a couple of times but I would like to try and incorporate some more sort of vegan and sort of vegetarian style recipes into my life it doesn't mean I'm giving up meat but I just would like to so the Thug Kitchen just makes these kind of recipes a lot more fun that you don't even realise that you're eating more sort of vegetable um, based kind of um, uh, meals really. Um, all the tabs at the top are all the ones that I'm interested in making. Any that I really like I might make on my channel as well so I can show you guys some of the recipes from it. They've also got a new one that's just been released and there's also a party one. So party one has actually gone on my birthday wish list. So hopefully I'll get that one. But I really like it. It just it's like really fun. It's really easy to read. Um, and they kind of make it seem like quite cool. And the fact that vegan doesn't always or vegetarian doesn't always have to be like super pretentious about it or anything. It's just kind of normal and it doesn't have to be really expensive. Um, but yeah, so I got that off Amazon, which I think was like £12 or something, but I'll link everything down below. The next thing that I bought was actually a Lumi case. Um, I have been wanting one of these for so, so long, and I've just thought they're quite expensive. Shall I get one? Shall I? I don't really know. Um, but obviously everybody knows like the Kardashians use the Lumi cases, and I was debating on the colours, but I actually wanted to go for black. I'm really drawn to like kind of just black and white things at the moment. I don't, I'm not loving all the rose gold anymore. I'm quite sick of it. Um, but yeah, so I kind of went for a black one, but obviously it just like makes it all shine up so you can get the perfect selfie. Um, I really love it. You can already see straight away like how much it lightens up my face um, when I take a selfie. Um, but it did take a little while to come and also I got a customs charge on it because it came from America, which was a little bit annoying. But I do really like it and a lot of people are like, oh, what case have you got? And when they see it, they think it's really cool. One of the next things is actually by um, Key Australia and it is by the Crispy Collection. So Crispy, obviously we know on YouTube. I think she's so beautiful. I love her videos. She came out with a sunglass collection and she brought out um, three different types, but one, which is the one that I've got, actually came in two different types so you could have it all like a rose gold kind of pinky metal or the one that I got which is like the pink lenses with the black frames um the case as well um she has a special sort of personalized one and it's just kind of like this iridescent like mermaidy effect but oh they look a bit dirty because I've been wearing them to death already okay so my battery has just died on my camera so I've just had to wait for it to charge up and come back so I can't actually remember where I was but I think the last thing I was talking about um, that I was showing you guys was my Key Australia glasses by Crispy um, and I think I've just shown them to you because I've got like the pink lenses with the black frame but on here I think because of the lighting it just looks completely black so it's really hard to tell like the pink I don't think you can see them at all but I absolutely love them although I had to pay 23 pounds additional customs like fees when they got here um, so they ended up 
actually quite expensive because they didn't have these ones on ASOS but a lot of them are on ASOS. I will link them down below for you guys and it's annoying you can't see like how lovely and like pink they are because they are just the most opaque like gorgeous pink um, lenses. Um, I'll link them down below for you anyway so you can check them out. One of the other things that I've bought recently has been a new jawbone. Now this is the jawbone up to, I've got it on now um, and I've got to say I'm so disappointed in this. I had the jawbone up 24 and I had that for a couple of years then it started to break it was just like being really inconsistent and it didn't seem to be tracking all my steps properly and it wasn't sinking very well so I bought a new one because I loved my jawbone I got a new one but I got this one this was only 40 pounds off Amazon and I thought because it was like a couple of years newer it'd probably be just as good as what my one was when I got mine a couple of years ago um it's not at all it only does like one update a day for me whereas before it used to update every 2000 steps and things it doesn't seem to sink as well sometimes it takes a couple of days I prefer the look of this one but I'm actually really disappointed in it and I don't like the Fitbits, I don't like what they look like at all but they've just bought out a new one which looks really similar to this one and it's about £100 on Amazon so I'll link this one down below for you anyway but I'll probably link my old one which is better which is a lot cheaper than the new Fitbit but also the Fitbit that I want to get I'll link down below for you guys so you can see the one I'm talking about but I'm really disappointed in this one but it was only £40 I don't really know what I was expecting. The next thing I want to show you is one item of clothing I have bought a lot of clothes that I haven't shown you guys um, just because I didn't want to just keep doing just clothing hauls all the time I like the fact I'm showing you guys something different that I'm buying but one thing I did want to show you because I'm obsessed with it and I love it is this bomber jacket that I got from New Look it's just a really lightweight like satin um, it's not actually by New Look it's by Cameo Rose so um, it's like a satiny feel with these lovely little white and green flowers all over it just with a zip and then it does have pockets as well so you can see like the pocket flap in there but I absolutely love it I think it was around like 20 pounds something 22.99 something like that but I just love how lightweight it is and it's so easy to throw over and it just goes with everything then the last thing that I bought is actually well actually technically it's three things in one was that I finally bought a MacBook Air I've got my iMac here and this is still one of the newer ones it's really lovely and thin it's a terabyte it's a really big one I do absolutely love it but sometimes I just don't want to sit at my desk um, and I just like the fact the idea of having like a laptop so um, the first thing that I've actually got from it is this marble case cover that says girl boss on it I got this from Casetify I love Casetify uh, they do so many amazing like cases and things and I will link it down below and inside it's just amazing it's all like furry it's so soft it protects it really really well so I got that to protect protect it so and then I got from Amazon just a marble case cover and then it's just plain on the back and I think this was like 10 or 12 pounds it was really really good value but I like the fact as well when it's on you still get the Apple does glow through but it's not on at the moment um, so I got the MacBook Air so this is the other thing the actual thing itself I got the MacBook Air 13 inch um, I've just been like that's what it looks like it's so pretty um, I've just been really wanting one for a really long time probably well over a year and I kept thinking no don't get it don't get it and then my work did like a scheme for me to be able to get one um, that worked out that it was like quite a few hundred pounds cheaper and I thought I couldn't pass up the opportunity so I finally got my hands on one and I thought it's perfect if I go away then I can use it I can edit on it I can sit in bed it's just easier just like moving around the house that is pretty much it so they're all like the new kind of there's some like randomly stuff in there some things I've at I absolutely love like I love my bomber jacket I hope you guys have enjoyed this video like I said I'll link everything down below for you guys make sure that you come and follow me on my snapchat Instagram and Twitter I have everything linked down below as always I have been snapchatting a lot more and in between like not doing videos I am like posting more things to do with like beauty and stuff so if you kind of want to know maybe some products and stuff that I'm using um, or if I'm getting any like the love me beauty boxes coming in stuff like that and you want to see what's in them then I am posting that on my snapchat so make sure you follow me which is just love by Steph also um, I'll have my username down below but I hope you guys are all having a lovely day thank you very much for watching I love you all see you next time